Good morning. My name is Samuel North Park Toyota. Recording for all posterity, everything I know about the Tundra. Okay. Start at the front. At the bottom. This is a three piece bumper. If any one piece of this bumper is damaged, it can be replaced or repaired without being responsible for the rest of it. Right here. Not just the Toyota logo, it's also a radar beacon so that you have uh, radar crews. Now because it's a TRD Sport, you have color keyed grill accents. Headlights, you have two different kinds. You have halogen headlights on the inside, which are better for being up close. You also have LEDs around the outside, which are better for distance. Moving on to the engine. 381 horsepower, 401 pound foot of torque, 32 valve V8 with design input from the NASCAR team. Now before we move too far, I want to show you something real quick. See those right there? Those are crumple zones. In case of a front end collision, the front of this thing is going to flip in half, drop on top of the front of the windshield so that you don't have stuff flying through the windshield at you at 60 miles an hour or whatever. This right here, this is how far we go with the detail. This right here is not soundproofing, it is fireproofing. These have a burn level of about 300 degrees, so if there was a fire in the engine compartment, this is going to drop down, land on the engine, and smother out the fire. Because this is a TRD Sport, it does have the fashionable hood scoop, very desirable to a lot of people. Part of the TRD Sport package is gonna be your upgraded wheels and tires. Unless you're buying a four-wheel drive off-road vehicle, this is the tires that you want because it's going to ride better. 20-inch, uh, comes with Bridgestone Duelers, which are very highly rated. Now, the Tundra is built, I'll show you up here, triple tech frame. There's three different sections of the frame of this vehicle. The front is a complete box. I, I can't draw for you. But it's a box, right? It's four solid pieces. When you get to right there, I go along the cab, back to here. There's another section of the frame back here. The frame is a C shape, like that. It's open in the middle so that the vehicle will flex a little bit so that it will ride better. And once you drive this thing, you're going to realize Tundra drives rides better than just about anything on the road, truck-wise anyway. Now, when you get to the back, at the third section of the frame, it opens up in the, it's a complete, but there's no box, there's no second part. So this is exactly like a three quarter ton. Meaning, if you put a trailer on the back of this truck, which I don't know if you ever will or won't, it's going to give such that you can't put too much on the back of the, of the tongue of the thing and damage the back of the frame, which happens if you have a solid box frame all the way around. You can damage the frame on a truck just from towing too much and that's how. TRD Sport logos. People put them on TR vehicles that are not TRD sports. Now back to safety. The Tundra, <clears throat> the frame runs right here. Obviously, that's where the, the hinge is. And also another piece of the frame right here. Inside of this door is an inch and a quarter of solid steel. That's right here and right here. Such that if the vehicle were to be struck, say in a T-bone type collision, the vehicle would be pushed through the intersection rather than you having to give your life so that the vehicle wouldn't have to. Also, there's another one right here and right here. If you take these door skins off, which I'm not going to on a $40,000 truck, it's going to have all sorts of crazy stuff. Now, I neglected to grab the keys. One of the things that is unique about the Tundra is this right here. That rear window actually rolls down. The frame might sound familiar if you know anything about vehicles because that's the, the way the frame on the Tacoma and the Tundra is built. That's another nod to that Tacoma four-wheel drive, the Tacoma Forerunner Legacy. It's also going to have that roll-down back window, which is really cool in Texas where it's ridiculously hot. You can crack that and it'll be nice outside. Auto high beams, yet another safety feature. This is adjustable height of your windshield. I mean, I'm sorry. Adjustable height of your headlights. So if you find yourself in a situation where you need your beams a little higher, you just adjust it up, 
or you can adjust it down whichever way in fog you usually want them down clear you want them a little higher up you can adjust it or you can just leave it where it is and get used to it which is what most people do now this particular truck priced at forty five thousand two hundred seventy six dollars has got a trailer brake in case you decide to tow a trailer it has a tow haul mode don't ask me what that does i have no idea it does have your push it is equipped with push button start now your radar cruise control your adaptive cruise control is set right here you push this button go down go up to increase or decrease speed or you can push it twice and use regular radar use regular cruise control now right here this vehicle is not equipped with navigation because we find that navigation is not very popular however it's also called fifteen hundred dollars it is equipped with apple carplay and android auto so if you're a a mixed family that one's got one, one's got the other, you both covered. This vehicle had, does have a dual zone climate control. So if, like every woman I've ever been around in my life from my mother on, <laughs> has a different internal clock than the men, you can adjust it either way. There's your fan control. There's your screen. As I said, I neglected to grab the keys. I apologize. There is another part of the TRD Sport package. It's going to have your nice... Uh, floor mats now something I wanted to show you this is just kind of how it sounds when you close the tundra <laughs> it's very solid very very solid this is the back seat of the tundra it's huge it really is I mean I, I've sold these things to people who then turned around and used them to sleep in the back of when they went hunting I don't know if you would do that in a bright red one but whatever there your rear AC and your port for your vents power windows power locks obviously those are standard child locks in case you have children or anybody else you don't want getting out of the back seat this one is equipped with your mud flaps your running boards that's not a part of the TRD sport package it's just something that we order on most of them I don't know if uh, my product knowledge is somewhat lacking on GM but watch this okay well I'll try again it wasn't really as impressive as I tried Got a cylinder in there to where it doesn't just drop if you happen to have little ones or big dogs or whatever it's not gonna just smack them on the head and there of course is our phone number you got my phone number here's your plug for your towing package super nice truck color keyed bumpers i don't know why he's selling i was trying to get 56 for it a while back but He's told me to make a deal on it. Sell it for uh, what we own it. Sell it for forty-five two seventy-six. Get you taken care of. Thank you.